Then once again, I surrounded the piece with foam core, popped in the hatchet, mixed up some silicone and poured in the second batch. And another 40 minutes later, it was cured and ready to be removed. We now have our first two-part mold, but this isn't the final one. Next, I mixed up a batch of Total Boat Thick Set Resin. I love using this stuff because its viscosity is very similar to water, so any bubbles that might get trapped will simply float to the top without resistance. Next, I put together our two-part mold, and then I sandwiched it between two pieces of plywood to add added pressure. Then I dyed the resin black, degassed it in my vacuum chamber to get rid of any air bubbles, and then poured it in the larger of the two pouring spouts. Now, since the viscosity of this resin is very watery, I find it takes at least 48 hours for this to fully cure. So for the next two days, there's not much I can do here but wait. A whole two days later, it was finally ready to be demolded. So I removed the clamps and opened it up to see what I got. Here we have an exact replica of our original hatchet. You'll notice all of the blemishes are transferred over as well. So to get rid of those, I'm gonna sand the entire piece. 